Today, you will fall in love with one of Germany's most romantic and picturesque regions, the Black Forest. We simply love it there. And of course, it involves Black Forest Gato and a little town that looks like a fairy tale. Hey, Leo from the beautiful Black Forest here in the south of Germany. Good morning. We are here now in the Fuchsbauernhöfe, which is an open air museum which features, let's say, the houses of a Black Forest. Yeah, they restored stunning houses here. And last time we came is now, I think, 32 years ago. Yes. <laughs> Can you believe it? Yes. And the first time I was here, I was probably eight years old. Yeah. yeah, I think the same for me, and um, yeah, it's, so it's your third time here as oh, well. I can't, you can't, I can't count how often I've been here. It's just wonderful, and yes. we think you will love it because, I don't know, the area, just the drive here is, it's just gorgeous. Yes, and the houses are amazing. Yeah. They're just amazing, and it's very interesting to, to see them. We hope you will love it, but we think you will. Now this farmstead is from 1599 called Hippenseppenhof. This is the chapel that belonged to the farmstead and it's really beautiful, small but so gorgeous. Have a look. So this used to be the Stube? Yeah, which is a kind of living room. At least it was warm because of the oven. Yeah. Here you have the traditional uniforms of the Black Forest with the very famous so-called Bollenhut and the red one means that you're not married and the black one means you are married. This is the epitome of the Black Forest. And here you have the famous Kuckucksworth. Here's another one. And here. This is a so-called laborer's cottage 
and it's from 1819. 1819, yeah. yes. Yeah. So 200 years old. Mm -hmm. This is the kitchen and this cupboard reminds me of my grandma. Yeah, my um, grandmother had one of these. Yes, yeah. our Oma in Lübeck had one like that and I have such great memories because I loved it so much. We also, when I was little, we used to have pots like that. Na, ihr drei? Alles klar? Hm? Alles klar. Look at the beautiful hands. I love them. This house is called Schauinsland House. Yes. And you said it's a rebuild. Yes, it's a rebuild. Mm -hmm. And the way the roof is well planned is very, very popular and common here in the area. Yes, and it's built in a way because of uh, very harsh weather conditions in winter. Yeah. Because you've got a lot of snow here. So yes. the roof yeah. has to withstand all the snow. Yeah. Beautiful. This yeah. is just black forest, as you would imagine it. Yeah. This is such a cozy Stube. Yeah. And in this area, as well as in Bavaria, you always have the so-called Herrgott's Winkel. Yeah, which is where you had a cross, or mm -hmm. a figure of a saint. Yeah. yeah. And where you can, let's say, worship. Yes. You find it in old houses, but still, even in new builds, yeah. like when so, they are built in this style. Yeah, it's a tradition. Yes, tradition. It's huge, that house. It's huge. This little garden is gorgeous. Yeah. It's like a, a very small cottage garden. Wonderful. And we have stunning weather now as well. This morning when we left, it was 10 degrees Celsius. Unbelievable. But that's always the same when we go to the Swabian Alp. It can be so cold even in the middle of summer or towards the end of summer. But here, we are so lucky. Honestly, so grateful. And now, look at this. This is a beautiful thatched cottage in the Black Forest. Now, as per usual, Jörg and I are on a lunch break and, well, we will share this. This is Kermitwurst and chips. Yeah. Now, this is basically a part worse with a curry sauce and this is... A very special sausage, yeah. Called Bauernbratwurst. Bauernbratwurst, yeah. yeah. So and we will share. It's a regional style sausage. Yeah. So we will have that because we can't have it in the UK. And yeah. Well, try. Mm. <laughs> and we paid 13 euros 50. And we are in a region that is very popular with tourists. Yeah. So. 
we we expected it to be a lot more expensive and for what we have here it's actually quite cheap it also includes water and this is what we really love here in germany apple schorle which is apple juice combined with water mineral water mm. very good is it good <laughs> of course it is it is i'm just glad that we walk a lot today because we need it you know what's funny these are like typical german chips but i also love the ones we get in the uk by the way i wanted to ask you something yeah yeah did you have to pay cash no they took credit card, took card yeah. wow because quite frankly it's a real problem here in germany and we're no longer used to it so many places even touristy places don't accept credit cards yeah. It's so always carry some cash with you when you're yeah. traveling in Germany. You're lost without cash yeah. still to this day. So it's very surprising yeah. to be honest, but yeah. yeah. So this here is the Vogtsbauernhof, which was the farmstead of the district governor, built in 1612. Yeah. The museum is named after this house, as it was the museum's first farm building. And it's truly stunning. It's an eye-catcher. Just look at this house. It's beautiful. It's truly amazing. And from 1612. So it's 400 years old. It's unbelievable. Yeah. And I'm so in love with this beautiful cottage garden as well. Yeah. The flowers in here are so dreamy. now we go to the oldest building yeah. it's from 1407 and it's called Schlösschen Schlössle Schlössle, Schlössle. Schlössle. yeah it's such a lovely word Schlössle yeah. I it's love like it small manor house yeah but a very small one <laughs> yeah very small and you said earlier this place is not only wonderful for adults but yeah. for children yeah children will love it yeah we loved it. Yeah, and I, re I remember when I was yeah, seven, eight years old, we came here and I loved it. Yeah, me too. 
never forgot it so yeah. it just it stuck with me and yeah. yeah coming here today brings back so many wonderful memories yes. we can really recommend it at it's not a museum in the sense of an old style museum no it's wonderful imagine here visiting a christmas market oh yes that would be fun oh yeah that'd be great let's put it on the list maybe <laughs> this is it so basically a house but schlesler is so charming The Schlössler, or Little Castle from Effringen. Yeah. And it used to have a little tower. Yeah. It's gone, isn't it? Yeah. 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 That looked beautiful. <laughs> Jörg is looking forward to having another highlight here in the Black Forest, which is Black Forest Gatto. We are now in Schildach. Yes, and Schildach's got a historic old town. It looks beautiful, and it's just a 15 minute drive from Vogtsbahnhof, yeah. so that's really great. Yes, and I want to get some. Yes, you have to do it. So we have coffee and kuchen here, if we're lucky. Jörg and I were lucky and found a cafe right away. It's called Café Bachbeck. Yeah. Look what he's got. A really, really, really big slice of black forest cutter. This is huge. I bet it's so good. It smells and good. This is for me cheesecake. How long ago is your last black forest gato slice? I can't remember. Huh? To be honest, I can't remember. You don't know? No. Is it good? It's excellent. Oh, yeah. <laughs> black forest can tell in the black forest. Exactly. What do this you is, want more? Exactly. This is how it should be. Drunk from all the Kirschwasser? Yes, I am. Is there that much in it? Really? Yes. Oh, it's a lot. It's a lot. My dad always says that. I mean, the black forest cutter is yeah. his favorite. And he says he loves the Kirschwasser in wow. it. It tastes so good. Part of the, the Black Forest experience, I would say. Mm -hmm. So this is the cafe. Coffee, Konditorei, Bachbeck. Let's see if we can spot some of the caves. Oh God, I had to catch my breath for a second because I thought the woman didn't want to be filmed, but she was fine. Look at this. So amazing. Oh God. This is a wonderful old town. We just love it. I mean, just look at the houses. They are stunning. Yeah, what do you think? It's gorgeous, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. It's a, a gem. We are in love with these two houses. Yeah, and they're really old. They are? Yeah. I can't see your finger. <laughs> yeah. This one? Yeah. Was built 1718. Yeah. Because that's what it says on the roof. Yeah. Really beautiful. Yes. And the thing is, we love houses like, like these ones, but we also love houses in the UK. Yeah. 
We love them all. Yeah, you find nice houses everywhere. Yeah, that's so true. Look at the houses behind me. And I just Googled and saw that Schiltach is recommended and is so close to Vogtsbahnhof that we said we have to come here. It's so worth it. It's so worth it. Absolutely. It's charming, picturesque, everything. We end this video in beautiful Schiltach. Yeah, we enjoyed the day very much. Yes, yeah, so, so much. It was so worth coming here. And yeah, we hope you will enjoy the video and the footage, the houses. Let us yeah. know what you think. And yeah, we'll see you again very soon. Yeah, we'll see you back in the UK. Yes. So take care and until next time. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.